The use of passive systems, i.e. the ones that do not emit any radio waves and are operating at the safe distance from the enemy, is the advanced field of artillery reconnaissance, battle intelligence and counter-fire activity. Such systems are automated sound ranging 1B76E and sound thermal systems 1B75E that detect and locate firing positions of enemy's artillery, multiple launch rocket systems as well as launch sites of anti-aircraft and tactical missiles while servicing the firing of friendly artillery. Depending on application tasks, in terms of the width of the reconnaissance zone, range and accuracy of determining the coordinates targets, these systems, based on sound ranging and sound thermal stations, can be supplied in various versions that can be combined into a single system. In this case, one any of the sound ranging stations can walk as a central point, the rest being slave points. The automated sound ranging system 1B76E solves the following tasks. Reception and processing of data incoming from sound ons. Measurement of coordinates of artillery tubes and mortars by registering bursts of shells and mines. Display of reconnaissance data on an electronic terrain map or plan and data storage. Deflection sensing of bursts of shells, mines. Destructive fire spotting using coordinates of the serviced artillery detachment. In addition to the functions of 1B76E, 1B75E system has additional benefits. Reception and processing of thermal data from gun flashes, explosions and flying artillery shells, mines, rockets and missiles, as well as maintaining a database from processing thermal and acoustic signals, including results of reconnaissance and service of fire. Sound ranging and sound thermal systems are mounted on the chassis of a Kamaz vehicle. The systems are designed for operation in adverse weather conditions. The sound ranging system includes the following main elements and assemblies. Acoustic Direction Finder, Antennas and Antenna Posts, Computer Equipment, Radio and Wire Communications Equipment, Internal Communication and Switching Equipment, Topo Geodetic and Navigation System, Small Unit Navigation Equipment for GLONASS System User, Power Supply System, Life Support System, and Combat Crew Workplaces. The system's field deployment and operation main stages are as follows. The system commander services information about the suspected hostile combat site by radio communication. After that, a command is given to take positions for reconnaissance. Having received the command of deployment, the combat crew of one station, consisting of five people, proceeds to install sound horns on the ground according to the walking scheme. After the first salvo of the enemy is located, its position coordinates are formed and automatically transmitted to the common post. Upon receipt of the enemy's coordinates, an order is given to open return fire. The maximum target reconnaissance range of the system can reach up to 38 kilometers. 
with an average error in target registration up to 0.6% scale division of firing angle. The principle of deployment and operation of the 1B75E system is almost identical to the 1B76E. However, it also involves the installation of heat direction finding equipment using a lifting device.